Guess whose turn it is? Not mine, because of the spinning. You rat bastard. Yeah. Now you're just doing it to spite me. Mm-hmm. No, th this is why neither one of us can tell the other anything. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, this- Oh my. You may have forgot there are a lot of boners in this room. <laughs> There's so many boners. <laughs> <laughs> now am I talking about where we're recording or the dungeon? Mm. Take these attacks for so, your face. So, was it a conscious decision that you want to keep playing with the Sister Brothers? Yeah, of course. Love the Sister Brothers. <laughs> I did it! You did it! Hooray! I bees. did it! Um, so, one thing I will say about the, the distinction between Salsa and March. Uh -huh. I feel like March's moves look cooler. Uh -huh. Like, I like the, the graphic on Full Moon Bind agreed. with like, the arrows going in or whatever Toads that is. Agreed. Power Blaze. I don't know what the hell that does. That probably gives it uh, its butt stat, like butt up. Uh huh. Butt up is good. Yeah, because you know how you have like attack down or whatever, and these guys are all like butts. Actually, these aren't the butt guys. Don't these, these are the block my attack. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Uh, on on Christmas Eve, uh, my family just happened to catch uh, Blast from the Past. Mm -hmm. and I don't think I'd actually seen that movie since it was in theaters. But, you know, it's it's one that you quote a lot. I had forgotten entirely how big a part of the movie it is with the Leave My Elevator Alone. Oh, yeah. It becomes, like, the basis of that religion. Yeah, man. Leave My Elevator Alone I is totally a really, forgot all that shit. really important part of that movie. I love that movie. It is a great movie. I also have not seen it in a really long I time. I really enjoy it. Whatever happened to Felicia Silverstone? She was hot. I, she, yeah, she super was hot. Nice to meet you. Uh, I had a major crush on her during, like, the Clueless era and Who whatever. didn't? Like, only, like, gay people and straight ladies. So a lot of people. Yeah, you know, <laughs> at least 50% of the population of the planet Earth. <laughs> but those people are all wrong. Not yes. because they're homosexual or whatever, nope. but because she's very attractive. She's very attractive. What the fuck? Did you hear that? She said sad souls. Sad souls. Sure, we'll heal Arrow. Is that, is that like the Chopin version of Sad Panda? <laughs> sad souls. Eh. Go, Sister Brothers! <laughs> Bam! Now, if if the Sister Brothers were like a, an NES or su uh, Super NES era of, of video game mascots, what do you think their defining characteristics would be? Cry, would, would it be like the eldest sister and two young twins? Would it be the same setup? Or, or like, what would their like characteristics? How, how would their personalities be? Um. Yeah, I think that's a pretty pretty good thing. I mean, obviously they'd have different colored hair. That's really the most important part of it. But I mean, they, they do still have... It's almost like this is actually what this... Because we got pink, purple, and yellow hair. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm telling you. We've got, like, ranged attack. I mean, I feel like... I feel like the only difference between the actual arrangement of these three ladies and, like, their hypothetical mascot counterparts... Oh, did you do it? No, I didn't do it. Okay. Uh, is that, like... I feel like there would be some more clear defining characteristic between the twins. Yeah, that's a good point. Like, instead of just being, like, blue and red, they would be, like, actual fire and ice or something. <laughs> that's so broken. Like, you didn't use any echoes, but you got almost every single hit from that attack. <laughs> kind of awesome. It's really stupid. Not bad at all. Lion's Mane is what I always wanted. Yeah. No, don't look at me. Oh crap. But Did Viola's gonna say... You really are. No, no you're, you appear to be looking at them. Okay, I was worried that I got back. <laughs> yeah, back. I know, they look close. It, it's weird because there is like a sideways like arc which you can back attack them and get back attack. Good look how, Lord, see, look that how ridiculous that is. so that much is. damage. And the problem is, for some reason, that is an attack that's like really easy to not have a chance to block. Um, so like, it, it can be oh. super devastating. Poop. Oh, it can be super devastating. Poop. I don't know what to do. You have um, to remember to chance when possible. Uh, I need to. 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 Oh, they all ended up at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> oh crap! I need to this. You can. You can. Oh crap! Oh, this is not going well. well it's fine. Just chance and be good. See, that, that worked out well. Woo. Yeah, heal. That's it. Don't attack. But heal. Don't whatever that is. I blocked it. Hooray! Uh, heal arrow. Just yeah, just good lord. Smash jam on the play box. I didn't get it off. Uh, you could, you could use one of your characters to 
Um, Club uh, Clover. Club Clover! There we go! We'd be in a, a lot better shape if I hadn't fucked us like what seven chapters What is it doing? Ago. I don't know. I wonder if there's there actually is some weird AI thing built in to like, if you're getting like fucked in a regular fight for the enemies to just start loafing around and like. Yeah. <laughs> Did you ever play the old uh, Monster Rancher games? Uh, no, I I don't I don't think I've ever heard of them. You, you don't know oh, about Monster it. Rancher? Poop. And it didn't like do anything. Poop. Mm -hmm. Uh, Monster Rancher, I mean, I found out about Monster Rancher from the anime, but I think it was a video game first. Uh -huh. And it was like a PlayStation game, and one of the weird things about it was that you could, um, you would, like, go to these, in, instead of just, like, wandering around the world and, like, throwing Pokeballs at things and Pokemon, to get the monsters that you would train, um, you would, you would, like, go to a shrine, and then, like, basically you would put any CD-shaped object into your... Uh, PlayStation, and it would read it, and then determine what monster you got based on that. Okay. Which was kind of a weird idea. That's interesting. But like, it ended up like you know you would sort of train them and feed them and like do a lot of stuff, and then you would like the way you would fight them was kind of like you know like a 2D fight or something like Street Fighter, except uh -huh. with the monsters. But the weird thing was, uh, if if they were at like low levels. Uh -huh. Then they would they would do this thing called tomfoolery. Oh my god, really? Yeah, it, it was it's the most hilarious thing to me. One of the funniest things in all of video games is like literally, if if you haven't like trained your thing well enough, mm -hmm. then it will like just commit tomfoolery whatever the fuck it feels like during a fight. So you're like, come on, I get punch the guy in the face, and then all of a sudden he'll just like whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> just like just like flop around in place, like, or just sort of like shuffle his feet. Where it hits itself. It, yeah, like it doesn't hit itself. It just like fucks around for a while, and then the other guy can hit it. But what was funny is, like, even when you were, like, facing the computer, sometimes the enemy would do it. So uh. that there would sometimes be, like, several seconds at a time where both of the fighters were just sort of, like, woo, loafing around and, like, neither one of them was doing anything. Like, imagine if that happened during, like, a boxing match or something. Both <laughs> guys just started, like, flapping their gloves around and, like, well, yawning well, really well. loudly, like, <laughs> Just, like, it's the weirdest thing. That was not fair. So, that, like, that that's sort of what the, the enemies remind me of when, when, like, you start... When we start doing badly in these fights and all of a sudden they're just sort of, like, shuffling their feet yeah, and poking right. rocks with their hands. Right, yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Yeah, those, those butt dudes are really easy to fight unless they do the charge attack and then you're The totally charge attack is, like, bone. really the only thing that gets you. Yeah. But for some reason they tend to just, like, do it all at once. So, like, yeah. you'll see several fights where you'll, like, not see it at all. And you'll even, like, forget that it's a move, and then, like, one fight where it's just like, charge, 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 your team's mostly dead. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like, eh. Look, it's a box. What's in it? I don't know what is in the box. I have actually, have gone absolutely nowhere. nowhere. It's true. We have remained in this room for eight minutes. Yep. <laughs> Approximately so eight what minutes. Else is, this is just a big arena of death and sadness. There's also that path upward. Did we actually explore that? I don't remember. Well, where did we... We came from here. We I came think, from I think south. the path upward is the only place to go. Yeah, that's... This way. Yeah, I think that's the way out. I was just saying in case you were confused as to where to go. No, I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. Right. Um, boom, 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 boom. Oh, I wanted to attack your butt, poop face. In the time it takes you to blink, I'm gonna pound you. Ooh. <laughs> Giggity. Yeah. And do you want her to work your kinks out? <laughs> oh. She's a little girl. What's worse, that coming from salsa or from beat? Uh, both. <laughs> both is worse. <laughs> Now, when you say both is worse, do you mean both propositioning you at the same time, or...? Yes, that's worse. <laughs> that is clearly worse. Oh, I blocked it. There's just not enough time to react. And it's very difficult. I'm just excited because I, I want to see you do it once. I really want to do it. Because I, 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 I want to see your reaction to how awesome it feels. One of these days. It would be sweet if I got it on attack like that. Is your, like, the damage you do... To them proportional on your the attack they do to you there's none of that right i mean your i think your attack is just the same as it would be if you had a normal turn i don't, I don't right. think that changes that's too bad that, see that move looks really cool too yeah. where it's all like flashing and seizure-y bonk oh so much damage did that hit two people i don't i, I think I, that might have hit march as well yeah definitely usually if it only well. hits one person it's fine but, like, if it hits two people, it's usually pretty bad for Yeah, you. it's kind of a problem. 
I guess one of the problems with the team sister brothers is that uh, two of them want to get up close. So, like, yeah. the charge thing makes it more likely for you to be kind of clustered together. Right. Unless you split your damage on two guys, but then, like, you have two guys going for longer because you're not focusing them at killing one person as quickly as possible. Right. God damn it. <laughs> slap, 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 boom! Alright, whatever. I just cleaned up it's fine. I have to admit that one of my favorite moments in this playthrough is still probably that time I did just three Mirage Blows in a row. <laughs> And that one guy just, like, I, like, messed up the timing on something. I was like, fuck it, more Mirage Blow. And then, like, the guy just exploded. <laughs> You're so tall, it's annoying. See, look at how tall these guys are. Their height is measured by the length of their weird front boner. <laughs> weird front boner. <laughs> Do you have a problem with the weird front boner? Do you prefer the weird rear boner? Definitely not. Okay. No, where's my heel arrow? Leave my heal arrow alone. Oh, dislike. Ugh. Oh, dislike. Oh. It's not fair. Not fair at all. There was time now. There was time enough at last. There we go. And not gonna miss that feel one. better. Oops. See, uh, actually, someone in the comments, I wish I could remember who, to try to fight it on the iPad, but it'll take me, like, the rest of the episode. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, but someone was kind enough to uh, elaborate on exactly what uh, March's version of the weird force field thing does. Uh-huh. What does it do? Um... You know how when we fight usually like scorpion type enemies, like yeah. they, they sort of resist some of our basic attacks and sure, they just do yeah. zero? Right, yeah. yeah, it does that for us. Oh, that's pretty sweet. I like that. I don't know if you've noticed, but there have been a couple times when we've had that force field up when someone comes up and it's just like, nope! Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's totally. pretty cool. Okay. I, I feel like I feel like March and Salsa are basically the same person, but March is like the emo high school phase that Salsa went through. <laughs> yeah, 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 totally. Yay! How is that? Pretty sweet. Good, I'm glad to hear it. Hmm, what is that status effect? Which under, one? Under Viola. Oh, that's the, the regeneration gloves that she has on. Oh, so well, at the what's start the of her one, turn, what's the one under March? Uh, I think that is just the icon for her defense force field. Because mm. I think it's like a sword with an X through it that's sort of like, attack less good. <laughs> oh, I wanted the heal arrow. You're doing all right. Yeah, I know. I just love heal arrow. You Leveled up. Do love heal arrow. What do we get? Nothing. Nothing. Yay! Let's save. Yay! You should do that. Saving the so game. Where are we at? Where are we at? I'm I'm consulting another ASCII map. Yay! My favorite. I never posted the other one. Yeah, I know. I posted a really passive aggressive. Uh, well, not posted. I sent you a really awful text that I apologize for. It's okay. It was not meant to be as serious as I realized it sounded later. <laughs> uh, One of these days I'll remember. You'll, you'll just post it randomly. Just not even in an episode where no we're context. talking about them. You'll just be like, ha ha! Covers the whole screen the entire episode. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go. Oh hey, great! I don't scene. have to consult the map because I think we did it. We did it. Remember, Beat is a it's Japanese like schoolgirl. Oh, he is a cool girl. I forgot about that. That is a... What is that? There's your ghost! Of course it's a There's ghost. your problem! That's exactly what a ghost looks it's like. It's some sort of UFO volcano. <laughs> so this is what's been living down here. Living? Ghosts don't what? living. That's it? If it's not a ghost, then it's no problem at all. We should go get Allegretto because he's only afraid of ghosts. <laughs> Alright, time for a boss Forget battle. exactly what this guy does. He's one of the random not human Wow, he's bosses. fast. Block it? I can't tell. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, do you like makes, that noise? Do you he like, makes a noise, all right. Do you like that noise? I oh, probably should have checked the item set, although I think we're probably okay. We'll see what happens. Probably should have healed first. Well, neither one of us was playing. I, I mean, I was checking the map because I thought we were getting close to the boss, but... I probably should have mentioned harmony that. Chain. That should totally have harmony chain. Yeah, there's been a couple of times where I think March specifically hasn't done her second one. Mm. 
I mean, Viola's a little bit more finicky right now because her dark doesn't have a second ranged move. And one of the problems with the Harmony Chain is you can only do moves that are currently in range. Mm -hmm. So, like, she can do her Night Arrow from anywhere, but she can't Harmony Chain if her other move is Bone Crumble and she's not next to someone. Right. Gotcha. Bam! Yeah, I definitely like March better for no reason. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I feel like I just sort of assumed they were basically identical and didn't give March too much of a chance. I mean, I played with her a little bit, uh -huh. but of, like, all the characters in the game with the exclusion of the PS3-only ones, I think she's the one I've actually played with the least. So, like, oh, this is probably the most I've used her maybe ever. Right. Die, please, and thank you. So here's, here's something I actually don't know, you know, with the sister brothers being like sort of Mario analog. Uh -huh. But like, what's the deal with Wario and Waluigi? Are they related to Mario and Luigi or just Lord each knows. other? Or like what? Lord knows. Can, do you know anyone who thinks that those characters are, are like really interesting? <laughs> uh, yeah, doesn't, doesn't Nick really like... Waluigi or something, or Wario. Well, he does play He's as the kind Waluigi of guy that would like those people. That's kind of true. But I just feel like they're so, like, they're, like, weird, and, like, as little character as, like, Mario and Luigi have, like, I feel like those guys have even less. Mm. Oh my. Did you see that? I did see that. that Remember was... that charge move that keeps kicking our ass? That was better yeah, than that move. That was that was pretty good. Thankfully, heal arrow. Heal arrow. And harmony chain. How many chains are really sweet? Yeah, yeah, I was I was trying not to spoil it because it's really cool to just like do it. Because like the first time I played this game, I had no fucking idea there were harmony chains, and then yeah. we get to this chapter, and it's like, so remember those really cool attacks that you do like much of the time? What yeah. if you did them twice as often? Yeah, they're pretty sweet. I gotta say. Yeah. But I will remind you that we are not at our maximum party level. I blocked it. Nicely done. Uh, Locked it B. I don't know if I've uh, ever actually mentioned this uh, in Encore mode, because, you know, like many JRPGs, this has uh -huh. um, a, a new game plus. Sure, so sure. In, in Encore mode, uh, you can set the party level to whatever the hell you want. So, like, because in order to get that game, you need to have played through the entire game, you can right. basically set it to the highest level and have all the sweetest powers right from the start. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that, that's one of the cool things about Encore. Like, normally... I don't care so much about new game pluses and generally don't play them. Right. But in this game, I made... I didn't, I didn't quite finish the game a second time just because I, like, had other games I wanted to play. Right. But, like, I got pretty far just because I was like, so I could fight the early bosses with the cool superpowers, you said. <laughs> Interesting. Hmm. No, I don't want that. It's also great just because you get to, like, really fuck up those mice and shit at the beginning of the game. <laughs> the mice. <laughs> Remember that time that Chopin just, like, one-shotted the entire mouse team? <laughs> Ready? I think I'm doing pretty well. Oh, look, he's sad now. But he, he resisted, resisted your How thing. dare he? Oh. How dare he turn his swordness to you? His attacks are really hard to block. He's got, like, a windsock for hair. That's fucked up. So far away. Eh. Oh, you're so close. This will do it. Yeah, do it from range. Phew. Oh, he blocked it. Give up the ghost, you ghost. Stupid ghost. Stupid ghost. Poop. You auto-blocked. Isn't that cool? That is uh -huh. cool. I wonder if it gets used up by doing that. It looks, it like, looks like it, it goes away. after that, yeah. I think you'll probably get it here. No? It's hard to tell if I block those or not. Come on, stay on target. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's see it. I'm ready. Oh, I missed it. Ah. Uh. Uh. That's weird. Why did Viola look sad? Because she's like it's, totally a. There you go. Uh, it's that little. See the X with the sword? That's yeah. the thing, I think. Hey, look, we got the Harabra. Look at that. Do you Harab know what that is looks that like? Is that for Jazz? Yeah, it is. Oh, Jazz. Let yeah, that's kind of interesting, isn't it? Leveled up. We got, what is with these girls? I don't. They're the sister I brothers. I don't understand girls. Nice. Leveled up. 
Everybody's level. I also don't understand whatever Saul says. Ha ha jokes. Ha 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 I should, but you need to get me one of those ridiculous Chopin top hats. Oh or, or the giant pocket. I really do want a giant ass pocket watch. So you want to be Flavor Flav? Flav. Like, kind of, but <laughs> like. Vasco Flavor Flav. Flav. <laughs> <Dick> <laughs> but like, I, you just, you can't get a pocket watch. Like, all pocket watches are like sensibly sized. You can't even really find the ones that, like, I feel like anytime I've seen a pocket watch, it doesn't look like movie pocket watches, which are kind of like palm sized. They're like smaller than that. Yeah. Like, I want, I want, like, I, I basically want a pocket watch the size of the Dragon Ball radar from Dragon Ball Z. All that's right. what I want. I gotcha. Because, I mean, I feel like that's about the size of Chopin, so that's that's what I'm looking for. Is anyone saying anything interesting? I know someone was talking, and this I was ignoring talking him. about tea, but he made us watch him drink it. Do I have to do anything here? Uh, I don't fucking remember why you're oh, here. Oh, cutscene. I, f I feel like we don't last, stay here very long. Oh, good evening. It's so fed. What is, do you know what that is musically? Solfege, yes. Solfege is like do la f fi la so la ti do. That's solfege. Is what just like doing the Assi yeah. Basically, you like assign words to notes. Oh, okay. Yes. So it's 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 kind of like that thing from the Simpsons episode with the tap dancing teacher. Tapa 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 tapa. Yes, sure. Kind of like that. Yes. So like do is a certain note, right? And la is a certain note. That's yeah. solfege. Uh, so you, like, basically, like, practice music by saying the words so you get a sense of the note positions. Anyway, what brings you to our village at this time of night? The human torch was denied a bank loan. <laughs> <laughs> Looking for polka. I see. You come to the people of polka traveling with. Uh, Wait, when did, did she ever have time to... I don't know. It's nice to meet you. Well, I guess polka had time to visit home. Nice to meet you, ma'am. I'm Allegretto. I know you must be in the movie. I want your very underage daughter's hand in marriage. I know. She's looking like it after us. We don't have to worry if it's both safe. Oh my, that's great. <laughs> my polka, very happy. M -m -m my polka, do 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 do. <laughs> Excuse me, but illness is pretty serious, isn't it? She looks fine to me. I don't You've know seen her do magic, haven't you? What a rude question. Her, it's a little different. What do you mean? Cancer. This seems like a like an important, uh, like thing. What do you mean? Like important story point that they're not actually making giving a. Real uh, to. I would imagine. I added? don't. Yeah, this may be new. I mean, cutscenes of this type are typically added. Some of them were in the original, but mostly, the new ones are like this. Mm. And I don't really remember, like learning more about how sick Polka was. Her her thing is bright, so tragic fate. And so she, she, has, she, has, the, she protect... has the Achilles problem. How the fuck does she know that? Because she saw the, the prologue at the start of the game where she jumped <laughs> off the cliff. She's been watching this series, haven't you? Come on. Uh, we can't fight her fate. Who cares about fate anyway? He did box opening gesture. <laughs> it's just such a Japanese thing. It really is. They do it all the time in like Yu-Gi-Oh too, but usually they're drawing a card from their deck. That makes me happy. All right, focus in the flower field, you guys. I also just finished. Um, I finished the main story of uh, Ace Attorney Five. How was that? And uh, it's actually it's quite good. Like there, there's some things that weren't fair. It felt a little bit short, and they had a couple of problems with things. But overall, it really lived up to expectations, mm. which I have high expectations. But one of the cool things is they they did you know in Phoenix Wright there's a lot of pointing. Yeah. They had three people point simultaneously, which oh my God. they could never do before because there weren't enough characters for it. The most amount of pointing. It's just so much objecting. Boots. And Cats? Cats. <laughs> it's a good cutscene. I'd love it if they had, like, a full, like, like, hey, Clave's dying length cutscene where they were just sort of like... <clears throat> it's like trying to figure out how to talk to each awkward other because they're like awkward uh, teens. 20 like, minute long awkward silence. Yeah, they're like uh, trying to date really but they don't get it. To do back in really important job. Running away from ghosts, it pays well. First ship that sails tomorrow morning. Sexy. I was wondering if you wanted to share my bunk. His boots. 
I'm sad we haven't gotten an extra costume so for Allegretto. We probably missed at least like one. We're far, we're pretty far in the game. I'm sure we yeah. have. I wonder if some of them are exclusive to Encore mode, though. Wow. I haven't really looked into it. From mm. way up here, it actually looks really beautiful. I probably should have, like, researched where yeah. they were so we could find all there, of them. All That's probably something I should have done. Oh, well. Yeah. Oh, well. No fashion show for us. Oh, I see. You excited for Strong Week? It's coming up. But I'm excited for Strong Week. What the hell are we doing? Huh? Something exciting. Things. Yeah. Exciting things. Y'all should be excited. I mean, do we want to talk about the fact that... Well, I suppose we either have to talk about it or not talk about it. Well, we should probably figure it out before we talk about it. Yeah. We'll talk about it. There weren't nearly as many lights then as there are now. Sunday? Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. Could be any Sunday. Any given Sunday. We have been friends for too long. Pop culture references. I know I used to look pretty, pretty soon we won't actually speak any English anymore. We'll nope. only speak like movie titles and weird song lyrics. It's totally. We could actually do that if we really Oh, absolutely. To. I heard Sexy Bitch on the radio today. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, it made me think of you. <laughs> <laughs> that song. That and Dynamite always make me think of you. Yep. I, I mean, I do throw my hands up in the air stars. every now and then. Yeah. Is the like a particular older, life philosophy that stars. you give off at that time? Maybe um, when the view started to get no. a little less no. Okay. no, no, no. I really haven't been paying it's attention stuff. to the I'm having a terrible time yes, focusing today. They're, they're, they're talking about how things are fucked and whatever and stuff. Yeah, and mineral powder and whatever. It's fine. <laughs> in fairness, in the in the ASCII map walkthrough, this is I believe this is a cutscene that it says you can you? skip, but we're not going to skip the cutscenes. You nope. Know, how's your health and all? <laughs> I mean... How's your, like, magic okay, cancer or whatever? So basically, the, the cutscene that we just saw was like, there's absolutely nothing wrong with her. So She's just gonna have to die someday. Yep. I even forget I have this illness. What illness? You don't have an illness! You know, She's super terminal. She has rabies. It's very and contagious. If I couldn't use magic, I don't think I would have ever felt this desire to go out and help other people like this. So you would have been useless. <laughs> If that had been the case, More I would have never set out on this journey. I mean, really, they're all useless, because it's just Chopin's fever dream. To meet you. Yeah, but, like, what if we could save him? What if everything we wanted you came in a rocket can? Oh, my God. I know, what so. if it did? That's why I'm so grateful what if it did? What if it did? Powers? I don't know if I've ever showed that to pro the professor. What? She That's may ridiculous. have seen it already. She, I mean, there's I tried a, there's to show her shoes, chance. and she was like, oh, I've totally seen this. What's the matter? You know. Oh, my God. I mean, it's fun and all to want to do things for Dishes others, roll. but... <laughs> we sang it the I forgot about We went shoe shopping yesterday, and we sang it the entire suck. time. <laughs> we literally just walking around going, these shoes suck. People you know, must have thought we were weird. To speak yep. up about well, people always think that, but I'm sure this didn't help. I mean, if you were doing it in that voice, people also might have thought you were, you were gay and, like, she would... Or... Which one is the beard? The girl is the beard for the gay guy? The girl is the beard, So she would have been your beard. Yep. things like that? Why do you say things like that? You may not have that much that you, time that left your, to live. That your girlfriend is a beard? I don't know why I say things like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just... Why are you yelling at the little girl? Oh, by the way, I forget if I also mentioned this. Uh, now now that uh, Ace Attorney is on the 3DS, they, they have like more assets. And one of them is that they, they have like real voice actors because there's a couple of cutscenes. Mm -hmm. Allegretto is now mm -hmm. Phoenix Wright. Really? Yes. That makes sense. He also plays Spider-Man in the Amazing Spider-Man games, oh. so he's moving up in the world. Good he's doing, like, all the best roles in video games. Good for him, yeah, totally. Well, so when they say objection in the 3DS, do their fingers, like, come out of the screen? I mean, if you have the 3D on, they kind of do. Does anybody ever have the 3D on these days? Uh, I mean, I usually don't, simply because the main time I play stuff is, like, when I'm on a plane or something and I want the battery to last as long as possible. Because mm. I basically only take, like, six-hour plane rides. Right. Yeah, I, I, the plane ride from Seattle to L.A. is not as long. It's like two and a half hours. Yeah. And it's a very strange experience to get on a plane and get yeah, off Yeah, I mean, I did that because my sister lives in Seattle. And so, like, when I went for her wedding last year, and my, my brother had his wedding in Northern California. So both of those are shorter. And, like, both of those felt really weird. And, like, I had sort of prepared myself for a six-hour plane ride, and then we just got off, and I was like, uh, this is right, weird what, now. What, what do I do? Yeah. Do you think I'd really jump off? Even if I well, yeah, I saw the prologue, so... No, you'd never do that. But thank you anyway for wanting to stop me from doing it. And then immediately after she says that, she just jumps off. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> we just talked about... Ugh. She's so contradictory. Yep. 
Uh, oh, by the way, I got a, uh, I got someone to, to, to watch our channel. Oh. Friend of the professor's. Oh. His name is Warren. Okay. Uh, he's a cool guy. So if you're watching this, hi. Please. I'm waving. Can't Let see it. Do you, do you, do you know sea. what he watches? I know at the very least he watched, or is it, watching. Did you see that fucking throw? <laughs> what? And then did it went like eight miles away oh from my shore. god. <laughs> She's got an arm. She should have been playing for the Yankees or something. It's fucking seriously. Jesus. So it's a good thing that uh, Chopin's Free Free Dream doesn't have a baseball team. I, I swear to god, there's gotta be some like Freudian thing to her being like, yeah, I'm just gonna throw away my special oh, treasure for no reason. Like she's so she's like having a psychotic How brain, yeah. and she's already a figment of a psychotic that's man's imagination. Me. Yeah, there's some problems I there. Found a rock with a weird shape today. Anyway, I got a rock. Oh god, what if she needed that rock? Did yeah. she need that rock? Wait, I don't know what you're talking. Huh? Keep it. Hold on to this one in place of the one you threw away. Is Why did she throw one? the other one away? It's Besides, basically the same rock. I'm sure this one is much more unusual. Look how weird the shape is. It's the same rock. Oh my god. Time travel. It actually reminds me of... Uh, but, uh, I haven't played it, but I watched someone... This one away, okay? there, there's After someone all, I watched who does like, a lot of uh, Japanese visual novel games. Mm -hmm. And there's like one that has... It's, like, it's kind of like a dating sim, but it also has time travel and cloning in it. Well, but, okay. like, in it, there's a very similar thing where there's, like, this magical, like, jingle bell, like the one from fucking Polar Express. Mm -hmm. And, like, someone throws it away, and then it comes back what and does, does terrible mean? things. All right, then. Could it really just be a coincidence? But here's something weird, is that when he picked up that rock on the beach, didn't he say he wanted to show it to Salsa? Why the fuck would he want to show it to Salsa? Did he say Salsa? I think he said Salsa. No, Maybe. this is definitely the exact same one. Does that mean? It's been mine forever. There's no way you will find out. out. I don't actually you, you don't remember? Don't you don't actually remember? All right, I don't well. think it's relevant. I think it's just like a weird, like, dropped plot thread. There's a couple. Of That's things. a pretty seriously but dropped plot thread. It is. Like, it up on the time travel, you guys? Oh, maybe they'll fix it in the PS3 version. Maybe. That rock wasn't my treasure because it was unusual. It was my treasure because the, I was... The only thing that, like, loved. kind of bugs me about this... Then why did you throw it away? Well, yeah. Know. First off, that doesn't make any goddamn sense. Know, but secondly, like, she said earlier that she got it when she, she like, just showed up with it when she was four years old. And her mom was like, what the hell? Mm. And she's like, oh, someone gave it to me. But, like, she clearly just got it from Allegretto now, and she's not four years old. Oh, my God. That was from Allegretto. How do you not remember that happening? Oh, my God. Maybe... Maybe when she jumps off the cliff, she reverts back to being four and has the rock again. It starts all over. Really? We'll see. Oh, oh my good. god! You need to stop this. We need to pause because. Oh. <laughs> this all right. Is, this episode's gone on long. Join enough. us next time for a extra slideshow. like twelve minutes of cutscene. Bye. Woo! Spring break.